slap battles updates are pretty bad. I'm not kidding, by the way. You may be wondering, how are they bad? To put it simply, the gameplay. Also, I'm mainly talking about the badge updates. Don't get me wrong though, there was a couple of amazing updates for slap battles that I actually enjoyed playing. One of these is Slap Royale, and I quite frankly think it's one of the best updates yet. The Slap Royale update basically gave us so much more to do in Slap Battles. We also can't forget about the Bob Boss Fight, which was another great update that I enjoyed a lot. Now you may be wondering, what are the bad updates? Let's just take a look at something like the Brick Master Badge update. To obtain it, you gotta place 1000 bricks without dying in a public server. To tell you that getting this glove was hard is an understatement. It takes around 2 whole hours of just clicking the ability to place 1000 bricks. That's not even counting the amount of time you put into this badge when you die. For some people, this glove is nearly impossible to get. The next badge will be something similar to this which is the Deep Slumber Badge. Now how do you get this badge? To get it you gotta use the Z Glove and use the ability for a whole hour. If you even get slapped or anything you will have to restart all over again. Do you get what I'm trying to say here? There's just some badges that require so much time and there's a chance you may not even get it. And the only time they will get some enjoyment from this is after they get the glove that comes with the badge, after countless hours of grinding for it. Now let's talk about the next badges that have a horrible obtainment method. Let's take a look at a badge like Demonic Ritual. Now I forgot exactly how it goes but it's either the whole server needs to equip the coat glove or just a certain amount, more than 10 obviously. Most people are gonna need to find third party websites to communicate with other people to get this glove. If you don't have access to that, you're basically gonna have to be lucky and find a server that is doing this. Now the last type of updates that I will be talking about is the one where you need to search up how to get it. An example is Leap of Faith, the description for the badge barely tells you anything and all you really know is that you gotta jump somewhere. To a new player, it will never really occur to them that they gotta go to Sky Limit and use the fish glove and land at the plate. In my opinion, games are not supposed to be played as a wiki searcher or YouTube tutorial finder. Like learning how to get every single batch yourself without anything to tell you how to get it is gonna be pretty painful to do. To wrap this up, I'm not trying to make this video out of hate. I still recommend for you to play slap battles under updates. This is just like a small message to the devs. I am also aware that they have a weekly update schedule and they have a short time to make updates but wouldn't it be better to just make bi-weekly updates or something like that and add more content other than just gloves each single update? This is basically the end of the video, see you next time.